Welcome to Foxtech. If you want to customize your Android home screen, there are plenty of ways to make it look exactly how you want. Let's go through the steps to personalize it and improve both the look and functionality of your device. Start by long pressing on the home screen. This will bring up a menu where you can change things like wallpapers, themes, widgets, and other general settings. Your home screen is more than just a place for apps. It's the first thing you see when you unlock your phone. So setting it up properly can make a big difference. Let's start with wallpapers and style. Choose a background that matches your aesthetic, whether it's one of the built-in options or a custom image. Many devices also let you adjust the color palette, which changes the accent colors of your system elements to match your wallpaper. This small tweak makes everything feel more cohesive. Next, explore widgets and app placement. Widgets can add extra functionality to your home screen, like showing the weather, calendar events, or music controls without needing to open an app. Some third-party apps also come with custom widgets that can make your setup even more useful. Experiment with different placements to get a layout that works best for you. If you want a completely new home screen experience, consider installing a custom launcher from the Google Play Store. A launcher lets you change layouts, icons, animations, and even gestures to navigate your phone in a way that feels more natural. Some popular options include Nova Launcher and Action Launcher, which offer deep customization features. Finally, if you, if you like a clean and minimal setup, organize your apps into folders or hide unused ones from the home screen. This keeps everything tidy and helps you focus on the apps you use the most. A well-organized home screen makes it easier to find what you need without unnecessary clutter. That's it. Now, you know how to customize your Android home screen and make it your own. If this helped, let me know in the comments. And if you found this video useful, don't forget to like and subscribe to Foxtech for more Android and tech tips. Thanks for watching and see you later.